kidding me? Come with me. Here. Look! Look at that, huh? Kid, you lied your way to hell on earth! I just... You just wanted a statue of yourself in your town square. I said, I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> Come on, kid, get up. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna die. No, you're not. You're Australian. We're impossible to kill. Yeah. I guess so. Unless... Not a Kiwi, are you? <laughs> no. Now, first things first. Yeah, come on, stand up. Follow me. I'm in here. Just I'm out. Butt into your shoulder. That's it. Cheek against the butt. All right, that's it. Point it where you want to shoot. That's it. Okay. Get your feet apart a little bit. beginning to think I already lost my Australians. What can I do you for? Not you, the boy. We need a runner for the front lines. Really? No. Yes. No. You can't make the kid do it. He'll just stumble into a firefight and get killed. No, no, no. I can do it. No. I'll do it. Fine. You're here with me. And you, you will be running.
didn't. No, sure fucking didn't. <laughs> nice shot. Oh, well, you know, I just kind of saw him out there and I... <clears throat> you got falling lines across the board. <sighs> That's what I thought. Bishop, go tell rear command that we'll be moving up. Hey, don't worry. I can handle myself here. Head down. Got him. No open areas. Got it? Got it. Got to get to rear command. For those who didn't hear from a runner, the Allied position is lost. Artillery fire ordered to cover retreat to beach, shelling the village and outlying forts. Shit. Foster! Fucking Brits. Shelling their own position to cover a retreat.
gotta help. Get out of here. Full scale retreat. They're gonna shell the village in the fort to cover us. We need to get out now. I, I sent men up to secure the fort. A dead man. Who went? Only those who volunteered, so naturally, all of them. Fucking kids. Well, you remember being his age? Foster. Fuck. I gotta get that kid. Go. I'll pretend I didn't see you. This isn't on you. Of course it is. One more death for me to live with. Go, go, you don't have much time. Storm on a fort by myself, and I called Foster a pinhead. Quit stalling, Bishop. Let's go.
Now, where's the entrance to this damn place? Again? You sure you didn't just want to shoot me? Come on. Let's get you out of here. This place is about to come down any moment. No, we can't leave. There are still hostiles coming, and we can't outrun them with our wounded. You get going, then. I'll cover your retreat. The bishop is still... I'll make it look like I'm capturing the fort. It'll be enough distraction. Once you get past Allied lines, send up a flare. Let me know you're safe. I'll make my retreat then. Oh, so you're disobeying orders now? Well, I assume you did to come here. Come here. There. You're a proper Aussie now. Gotta look the part. Right. Up and at him, lads. Let's go. ways to go. This is it, I guess. Dur dur dur! 
Çıkarsan canını çok yakmayacağım. Seni bulacağım, ses seni geberteceğim. Görüyor musun? Şuradaki ceset mi lan? Lan başlayalım. Lan biti. Ha? Bu. Ah! <laughs> 
Better be close. We can't keep this up.
in the deserts of Arabia, an insurgency war was raging years before I got to France. Tribes of Bedouins had united to fight a war that was very different from the one we fought in the trenches. Using small mobile units, they challenged the might of an empire, and they were rallied around the ideas of a single influential warrior. Ideas of freedom and change. The Arabian Desert, a vast ocean of drifting sands and scorched, sun-baked rocks. Beneath these endless dunes, oil, the lifeblood of our new mechanical century. For more than 400 years, the Ottoman Empire has ruled these lands, controlling all that's to be found here. But the Ottomans do not rule unopposed. Small bands of Bedouin rebels have united to overthrow the empire. They strike without warning and then vanish into the desert. Fighting alongside them is a lone British officer whose exploits have earned him wide renown. The world has taken to calling this man Lawrence of Arabia. In the desert, you rely on good planning, but you also hope for a dash of luck. And luck was with us when we learned of a recently derailed Ottoman train carrying a most interesting piece of cargo. A small patrol had joined the Ottomans who survived the crash. Together, they guarded the wreckage and waited for reinforcements. A lone fighter has just one advantage over a large enemy force. A lone fighter can move unseen.
cry havoc and let's <laughs>